We are having some pretty epic weather in the UK at the moment for a change and literally for the last week or so it's just been bright blue sky with amazing sunshine. Now in true British style I have heard quite a few people saying oh it's too hot moaning, oh, I can't do anything in this heat. Uh, I can guarantee you that's something you will never hear from me. I love it when the sun's shining. I think I'm kind of like a lizard and my body sort of functions better in the heat. But um, yeah, I've gone off on a bit of a tangent there. Back to today's video. We are taking a look today at another pair of sports sunglasses, but this time round it is from the brand Sun God and it is a pair of their run specific sunglasses, their new Ultras. Welcome back folks, I'm Lloyd Purvis and you are watching Run For Adventure. It's great to have you back and I hope you are enjoying some amazing weather wherever you are in the world, like we're getting down here in Cornwall. It really has been sort of perfect sunglasses weather. Uh, before we dive into the video, what I will say is hang around till the end because the kind folk from Sun God have actually given us a pair of ultras to give away. So one lucky viewer is gonna have the opportunity to design their own pair of custom ultras so it's definitely worth sticking around to the end. I've been testing out the glasses for over a month now and I've run lots of miles and I've ridden a few miles on the mountain bike as well. Before we go into how they've performed I'm just going to give you some details when it comes to the construction and what turns up in the box when they arrive. Uh, obviously you get a super cool pair of running ultra sunglasses but they do turn up in this very sort of substantial hard box. Happy to say fully made out of recycled materials and that's going to be a pattern that follows through this review. Uh, the box has actually got magnets on it so I think it actually double up as a pretty uh, sturdy sort of hard case to give your glasses a bit more protection. Also in the box you get this handy little leaflet which gives you sort of a brief overview when it comes to your frames and your lenses and the materials that have been used in their construction and it's got a really handy little care guide at the bottom there how to look after your sunglasses. Again made out of recycled recycled material. We've got this little sort of business card thing with uh, a link to uh, Sun God's owner's guide and also a link to their Strava Runners Club. Again, made from recycled material. I told you there was a pattern forming here. Uh, a little bag with lots of different sized nose pads in. So fully interchangeable so you can get that sort of desired customized fit to your sunglasses. And this little black envelope which I wasn't sure it was in it but when you open it up it's got a real cool selection of Sun God stickers and I love a sticker so I'm sure these are going to end up on the adventure bus at some point and then finishing up we get a really good sized uh, soft case but this also doubles up as your microfiber cleaning cloth. Now just before we go into the construction, Sun God go about their glasses a little bit differently to a lot of the other brands out there. So basically the Ultras are fully customizable when you order. So you can choose uh, the material used in your frames, the color that your frames come in, the tint you have on your lenses, down to even the color of that little logo on the side of the frame there. So there is lots and lots of options to choose from. When I went through that customization, I went for the infinite 100% recycled frames. Now, these are made from the same ultra durable material, but it has been sourced and manufactured out of 100% recycled plastic waste, which I think is awesome. When it comes down to my lenses, I went for the gold tinted 8K optic lenses from Sun God. Uh, these are actually constructed out of 2mm nylon, making them optically superior and lighter than industry standards. Uh, don't worry if you don't like a gold tint because Sun God have actually got eight different tint colors to choose from, including two iris photochromic lenses, which are going to give you maximum optical clarity in any lighting condition. So I think they've pretty much got everything covered. The lenses offer 100% UV protection and they've got a triple layer coating. So they are scratch resistant and impact resistant. Obviously, you get that full clear field of view from that frameless design and the lenses are also fully interchangeable. When it comes to the frames, I love this Sun God call it, 
they've adventure proofed them, which is awesome because we love a good adventure at the channel. So they are constructed from an extremely lightweight but very flexible material and the ultras weigh in at a crazy light 26 grams. Like I mentioned earlier, you can have your frames constructed out of recycled materials or non-recycled materials. We've got very secure pop locks uh, on the hinges there of the arms and we get Sun God's grip lock technology on the ear socks. And then we've got that innovative frameless design that's going to give you that nice, secure, bounce-free ride no matter how far you're running. And then last but not least, those frames also come with a lifetime warranty. So, you know, if they break or you even break them, Sun God will repair them for free. And that is a great service. So prolonging the lifespan of your sunglasses, but also reducing that collective impact on the planet. So nice one, Sun God. So there you have it, a bit of information about the spec and the construction of the Ultra sunglasses. And you can see that there's some pretty techy materials and manufacturing processes going on at Sun God. I also really like that they seem to care about the planet and they're very accountable for their actions and I would say pretty much everything that turned up in the box has been made out of recycled materials down to even the microfiber cleaning cloth and bag. I don't know whether you can see that on the camera but this has been made from recycled plastic bottles. So, you know, that's some serious attention to detail. And the Ultra sunglasses have actually been certified as a carbon neutral product. Right, I guess it's about time we talked all about performance. And, you know, with the Ultras not being a cheap pair of sunglasses, retailing at 130 pounds a pair, you would expect top quality performance for that kind of price point. So let's go into the uh, 8KO lenses first. I went for that gold tint as my option and it has been perfect for my needs, giving me great levels of protection when the sun's up high, really bright. It's taken away any glare, stopped me having to squint or strain my eyes. But it's not too dark that if the weather changes, it clouds over or I've had to run and ride through a section of woods, I can still actually see where I'm going. And they've given me really clear vision. And having that great field of view from that wraparound lens design, literally having no frames to get in the way or to sort of catch in your peripheral vision you really can feel like you're not even wearing sunglasses uh, talking of frames if we can call them frames uh, super lightweight great fit and very comfortable I think having four different nose band size options is a great touch and it gives you that little bit of extra personalization to your sunglasses and those rubber grippers on the end of the arms have done a great job so zero movement whether I'm running down a steep descent on the coast path or I'm bombing down a rocky gully on my mountain bike, these sunglasses have stayed put and felt very secure. I've used the Ultras on some pretty challenging, very hot training runs lately and I've had no issues with sweat on the lenses, no issue with fogging up or glare or reflections or anything like that. And you know, I can't really fault the performance of the frames when it comes to the fit and the comfort or the performance of the lenses. And then I love the fact that it seems that every element has been thought about when it comes to the brand's impact on the planet. Like their little tagline says, leave no trace. You know, I love that. And I think a lot of the other running brands out there should take note and maybe follow Sun God's example. Now, it's pretty obvious that I enjoyed the performance of the glasses, but I do think it would have been nice if it came with a proper hard case so you can get a good level of protection for your sunglasses. Uh, I have got a case, but you do have to pay an extra £15 for it. It's a great, well-made case nice soft uh, internal liner and we got a good quality zip on it but it would have been really good if it was included in the price especially when they cost 130 pounds that is the only slight negative i've got when it comes to the ultras so wrapping up with a quick conclusion and yes they do cost 130 pounds a pair but you are getting yourself a premium pair of sports sunglasses for the money when you think of that great design the fantastic lenses and the fact that you can really tell that a lot of time care and effort has gone into making them super functional when it comes to a runner's needs and then you've got 
all those great little attention to details, which just highlight that the brand Sun God really care about the glasses they're producing, but also the service that they're giving their customers. And when you take all that into consideration, especially the fact that the frames come with a lifetime guarantee, you're actually getting quite a lot for your money, especially when you compare them to other sort of high-end sports sunglasses manufacturers. Now, don't worry if you don't want to look like you're on your way to a 1980s roller disco. I understand this look isn't for everyone. I mean, I love it. I think it's super cool and retro. Or you haven't got the budget to spend 130 pounds on a pair of sunglasses sun god have got an extensive range lots of different styles lots of different lenses and lots of different price points so i'll leave a link in the description below so you can check out their full range and like i mentioned we have a pair of ultras to give away to one lucky winner so how do you have a chance of winning well the first thing you need to do is get in the comments below and let us know why you should win an uber cool pair of running sunglasses and i would say make it as funny as possible then you gotta head over to instagram really sorry if you're not on instagram but unfortunately that is the way the world works now uh, you have to follow run for adventure on instagram but also sun god sunglasses on insta and then last but not least under this picture in our Instagram feed, you need to tag in two of your running buddies who you think need a new pair of sunglasses. The competition is gonna run till the end of August, and then we'll be picking out one lucky winner at random, and you're gonna be walking away with a super cool pair of ultras. I just wanna take this opportunity to say a massive thank you to Sun God for, first of all, sending me out a pair of their brilliant ultra running sunglasses to test and review, but also, for putting a pair up as a giveaway. You know, we love giving back to the viewers just to show our appreciation of all the amazing support we get. So massive thanks to Sun God. I know there's quite a few things you need to do to enter, so I'll leave all the details in the description below. So don't worry and best of luck with the giveaway. If you have enjoyed the video, don't forget, you know what to do. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It really is a massive help when it comes to the crazy world of the YouTube algorithm. And it just allows more people to discover the channel but for now guys thanks for watching it's really appreciated we'll be back here very soon and as always stay safe and keep on running one lucky viewer is going to get the opportunity to uh, before we go into how they've performed i'll just give you a few details when it comes to the dis destruction <laughs> not the dis i'm not going to break them not the destruction maybe the construction <laughs>